Good morning, welcome to Scotty Crafts and Wendy's World. Today I want to talk to you about the Sizzix Embossing Diffuser. A lot of people look at this and go, what on earth is that for? So to get rid of all the confusion, I'm going to show you how they work. There's a couple of samples here. There's a... You, you know, before you start, that looks like an embossing folder and it uh -huh. isn't. No. If you just slide the camera down and along the bench <gasps> here, I'll show you what's actually in the packet. So there's six different ways that you can use <gasps> this little package of goodies. Yum! So if you pop one of these on and put your piece of card into your embossing folder and send it through with this sitting on the top, you will get this look. I love that card. So, so you only get embossing on the one... Yeah, it leaves the centre blank and embosses where the pressure will hit, which is where this piece right, of so transparency is. Right, so it leaves the middle the not The middle embossed. will be flat so that you can then stamp your words in. <gasps> and and then... alternatively, you can take the centre piece. You can sit your piece of card into the folder and on this little sample I've only sat it over the top. I can choose where I put it on my folder. Love right that in the idea. Center. That's so nice. So I'll show you how it works. You pop your piece of paper in. I've previously done just a half circle because I just want bits of this embossed. I don't want the whole front embossed and I don't want to do a frame. I want to just play around with it. So I'll now pop my piece of card back into the folder, lining up my previous design. Uh, this time I think I'll put the little circle off to the side. Now because of the thickness of this, on a Big Shop machine you don't use one of the cutting platforms. Okay, so it's the same thickness it's as It's the same a... thickness, so you take one of the platforms away. Same thing with the cuddle bug and same thing with the e -bosser. So I've chosen to put my uh, circle here, so this is the only area that it's going to emboss. Oh, now I'm right. going to pop my one cutting platform on top and I've only got tab one down and I'm going to roll it through. I'm going to bring it out the other side and now magically I'm going to open my folder and now I have only the two areas embossed. Isn't that cool? So you can play and have a lot of fun with that. You can just basically put it wherever you like on the card face to create a circle. So even with these the, these folders you can do the same, you can move it up and down the card. It doesn't have to necessarily sit in the centre. I want to see that So one. that one I used the oval and I used the cogs um, and then I've gone over the top with metallic distress paints and then rubbed black ink over and where the flat area is I was able to stamp it. Lovely and <coughs> I like what you've done with this because this That's is on her transparency. Book cover transparency because it bruises with that white image and then it's left the centre of the card clear where I've focused in on the stamped image of the birds which is a La Blanche stamp. Oh, it's very, very cute. So you have used all these different embossing diffusers to make patterns on your paper. And you can use any embossing, embossing folder. Folders. Yeah, totally. So you can use all of the uh, texture fades, you can use the couture creation embossing folders, you can use the spellbinders emboss embossing folders, anything that will give you texture. And it's just a matter of changing out your boards to make sure you've got the combinations right for the pressure. Very, very cool. Love that idea. And I love this embossing diffuser. When people know what it is and what it does, it's it's just such a hit, hey. It's an awesome tool. I'm waiting for them to bring out other shapes in it now, Adrian. They'll be that they'll be I'd good. Like but you've just shown rectangles. Us, I know. Well, that's cool, but you've just shown us how to do some amazing things here. It is awesome. It's so easy to use. Yeah, thank you, Wendy. You're welcome. And don't forget you can get all these things on Wendy's World at www.scottycrafts.co.nz. Click on Wendy's World and you will see Wendy. We'll see you and soon as well. All the bits. <laughs> see you soon. Bye. Bye.